Hey guys, so today I have got the July Cures and Curses box to show you. Now for anyone that hasn't seen me open this before, it's $29.95 and I do have a discount code for 10% off which is LUNA10 so I'll put that here on the screen now and I'll put it down in the description below as well. Um, this one is a very big box and it does have the normal bag in there but it also has an extra item on the outside as well. So... This is our little envelope that has the um, the sheet and the print in it. If you watched my one last month, this was actually missing from that one. Um, they did email and apologise and say it was supposed to have one in it, but for some reason mine didn't. Or maybe it did and I'm just stupid and I couldn't see it and I through the box, I'm not too sure. But this one is a Lamas secret satchel for July and we do have a big list of everything that's in the box. I'm not gonna go through this, I'm just gonna show you, but you do get that. Um, and there also is some like bread recipes and stuff to try. So I'm gonna just hold this up in case anyone wants to pause it and read it or write it down or anything like that. So that is the little sheet. We also have a print, which looks like this. So that's our little print for the month. And then I will show you the biggest item in the box that's outside of the bag. Um, this does have kind of a purpose, you'll see later on in the video, but we have the Witch's Brew little teapot which is really really cute i already have the matching um like cup that goes with this i've got it in black and in white so this is very very cute it's supposed to be like a little cauldron these which is brew on it i will get it out of here and just show you okay so this is what the little teapot looks like and oh there we go that is the lid very very cute Just pull your little tea out so that is i would say probably the main item in the box this month and then we have our normal little satchel with all the other items in it so it does say in the little um like description sheet that this is raw cotton this month in case you want to like tie dye it or dye it yourself or just use it as it is or whatever so they haven't colored it this month they've just left it plain in case you want to color it yourself so that's cute um then in here the first thing we have is this which is cures and curses signature golden skull wax melts um, it says presented in a sorted sense, crafted from 100% soy wax, from sustainable sources, and pure natural essential oils and fragrance oils. So, let's have a see what these smell like. It does say they're assorted, but I would like to see if I can kind of see what any smell of. Oh, okay. There's no chance I'm ever going to know what they're going to smell of. They smell like, like incense sticks and like herby kind of smells. It's really nice, but I thought they were going to be maybe fruity or something. Um, they are very shimmery, so I'm just going to get one out because I'm going to get covered in glitter. But this is what the little skulls look like. They look like maybe when they melt down, they're black inside. Really, really cool. There is three in there i think so that is those next we have this one which is moroccan mint loose leaf tea now i don't really love herbal or fruity teas but i do like mint tea so this is definitely a win for me um it says it's a blend of gunpowder and peppermint tea uh, mint is one of the sacred herbs of the druids and at this time of the year its properties of drawing abundance and prosperity are highly valued as well as the magical properties of protection and healing brew with freshly boiled water best before december 2023 so this lasts for a really long time and um, this is a giant bag which is amazing i'm going to open it just so we can kind of see what it looks like I also heard that mint tea is good for like losing weight and stuff. Um, smells amazing. 
it smells like spearmint more than peppermint which I like but that is what that looks like in there if it would focus it's probably not going to focus but that is that anyway then we have some reusable muslin tea bags to go with the tea which is very very cute there is one two three four five little bags like this so you would put your tea in there and hang this over the side and then when you've used it just empty it out wash it and you can reuse those very very cute didn't even know they existed very environmentally friendly i like that then next we have this witch's altar little broom decoration really cute just a little like handmade broom you could put wherever you like you could even maybe try and turn it into a pen not sure how you would do that but kind of looks like it'd be a cute little pen so there is that and then we have a peppermint and pine essential oil room spray i love room sprays so this is amazing it says a blend of peppermint and pine essential oils with witch hazel to bring a light and refreshing aroma to your altar space or any room which needs protective and healing properties of mint so that is really cool it does come with this little spray and it unscrews at the top so it's kind of been sent you know so it doesn't spill which again amazing whoa smells very 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 strong super super minty really refreshing though so that is really cool little room spray well big room spray and then the last item in here which is kind of a two-in-one is this really cute little chest a little wooden chest it has little flowers on it and a little lock on the front and in here, I'm probably going to absolutely butcher this, but it says a shiver lingam stone. So I'm going to put this down. This is what this stone looks like. I have never seen one of these before. It's kind of like a long egg shape and it's really, really smooth. The little sheet says, this seed shaped stone helps you to envisage the seed of thought planted for this year's harvest. It's an elite stone when it comes to raising aspects of fertility, sexuality, confidence and balancing stabilisation. So that is very cool. It's like a, a bit greeny and brownie coloured and it fits pretty perfectly in this little box so i will probably just keep it in there because that is very very cute so that was everything in the july cures and curses secret satchel i will get it all together and show you again all at once so we have the print the skull wax melts the mint loose leaf tea the little altar broom i'm gonna put the print down because i can't hold the print being so big with everything else um, the room spray which does also come with the little like spray top the reusable tea bags for the tea the giant witch's brew cauldron teapot and the really cute little wooden chest with the stone so all of these items along with the print were in the july cures and curses box um, I really liked this one. I think this little chest is actually my favourite. It's really, really cute, but I genuinely loved everything. Um, you'll have to let me know what you thought of this one down below in the comments. I will put all the information for them down in the description as well, in case you want to go and check them out. And I hope you liked the video. If you did, please subscribe, and I will see you soon. Bye, guys.